configure the database server. The first step is to configure the minimum database permissions for the service account or Microsoft SQL Server account. If you are installing BES 12 using the existing Microsoft SQL Server in your organization's environment, you might need to add the service account or Microsoft SQL Server account to the DB Creator Server role. In this scenario, we will add the server account named BESadmin to the DB Creator role. On the computer that hosts the Microsoft SQL Server, open SQL Server Management Studio. Make sure that you log in with an account that has sufficient permissions to create database users, such as a system administrator, and then click Connect. Expand the Security folder. Right-click the Logins folder. Click New Login. Click Search. Type the name of the account that you want to use for database communication. In this example, type Administrator. Click Check Names. Click OK. Click Server Roles. Select the following server role checkboxes DB Creator, Public, and Sysadmin. Click OK. Close the window. The next step is to verify that the TCP IP is enabled if your Microsoft SQL Server and BES 12 are on separate computers. If the TCP IP is not enabled on the Microsoft SQL Server instance, BES 12 cannot communicate with the database. Open the SQL Server Configuration Manager. In the left pane, expand SQL Server Network Configuration. Click Protocols for MS SQL Server. In the right pane, make sure that TCP IP is enabled. If required, double-click TCP IP and set the Enabled field to Yes. This completes the task of configuring the minimum database permissions for the service account.